guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be cleaning and decorating my back patio. So at least half of it, of course, just this half, like our little conversational, relaxing portion of the back patio, we're gonna be cleaning and decorating it. This is Brooklyn back there. Brooklyn, say hi. 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 She's gonna be helping me, at least with this earlier part. Um, so yesterday I took off the cushions I got, I washed them in the washing machine. It just zips off. I'll show you them right there sitting on the floor in the kitchen, nice and clean, ready to go. Um, I'm just going to take a little vinegar and water and wipe down the seats, the table, this little ottoman and small side table. We just got that maybe what's today, four days ago. So it's not really that dirty, but we'll give that a little wiping down as well. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, like I said, my name is Dream. I am a mama of two. I have a three-year-old daughter named Brooklyn and a 16-year-old son named Dominic. Um, we live in California. I live here with my husband and my two kiddos. Um, we have been in lockdown like the rest of you guys, and I have sourced a lot of my materials. I've bought a lot of things online or just frankly for my local grocery store, one of the main places that I go. I did run into Tractor Supply this weekend and I picked up a few items from there as well. Um, we're also going to, um, I think I'll hose off the patio and sweep it down, but let's just jump right into this video and get started. If you guys enjoy this type of content, please give it a thumbs up and I would love, love, love for you to join our little YouTube family. I make mommy content and mostly I make cleaning and organizing, all of that kind of stuff. So guys, we are just going to use a vinegar and water solution to wipe down um, our little patio set. We have had this patio set for about five years, maybe going on six, and it has held up great. We ordered it off of Amazon. It was super duper affordable. And we, before we moved to this house, we lived in a small townhouse. It was perfect for the patio. So we've just still used it at this house. Our next house, we'll probably need to get something bigger because the next house is gonna be bigger, but we have never had a backyard. So our backyard at this house is not huge, but we have never had one, so it's bigger than what we've had. We lived in a townhouse in San Diego, but we were close to the beach, so the trade-off. We could walk to the beach, but we just didn't have a backyard. So I am going to make sure to wipe down all the pieces. Here I'm wiping down the table portion. Um, this uh, table, actually the glass pops off, um, which is great so you can get on both sides and clean it thoroughly. Like I said, we've had this patio set forever and everything has held up pretty great. side of the patio so we can sweep over here and um, get it all cleaned up. This table had two really big spider webs underneath and I was like so grossed out. And then also watching this clip back, Brooklyn in this mirror just gave me a heart attack, but not this mirror, this glass gave me a heart attack, but thank goodness everything was fine.
oil and we ripped out everything in the um, flower beds. We, re we redid those and then remulched those and I think it looks so good. He did such a good job because it was not looking good. It was just not it. <laughs> Um, and then I'm gonna use the hose and go over it. You're gonna see that there, I did not put soap on this ground, but my child literally spills bubbles all the time. So there is tons of soap like dried into the concrete. So that's why you're gonna see bubbles, but that's fine, it helps clean it. And that is also a reason why I will not put down a, a rug because it would just be filled with bubbles and paint and just craziness. I want to say it was under $300. The blue pillows that we're putting down on it, those we got in a set of two, and I know those were super affordable as well. All of that stuff, I kind of just throw it in the wash and it becomes clean. That white pillow, we picked that up from Walmart recently, so you can find it at your local Walmart. It was only $12.99 in the outdoor section, so it is an outdoor pillow. These lanterns were only $17. $14 a piece and those we picked up from my local grocery store. I am going to get some twinkly lights, some outdoor twinkly lights to put in them. I think it'll give it a great little pop. Um, this blanket, I've had it for years and years and years and it is from Target. Um, while the ground was drying a little bit, it's still a little bit wet. You'll see a few wet spots here and there. But um, me and Brooklyn made some lemonade, so we're gonna bring that out in a bit. Um, the ottoman, the two ottomans and the side table we got those also from amazon but they sell out super duper quick they were only $9.99 for all three pieces and then this outdoor mat when you come out was only ten dollars i'm actually going to get another one for the other side um, i think it's really cute we got it from target um the lantern we already talked about that one and then this candle is on only um I think it was around seven bucks and it smells so good as well. And um, that ottoman actually has storage inside because you can just lift it up and there's storage inside. Um, over here you can see when I stuff the cushions back, I didn't do that good of a job, but I think it'll flatten out when we sit on it. And then this tea towel was $6.99 and I got it in a, a set of two from Tractor Supply. The candle was around $7 and I love that it was in that little rustic pot. Um, and that was also from Tractor Supply. These um, flowers, not flowers, but ca um, these plants here, we got those from our um, local grocery store. And then the lantern, like I said, was $14.99 from our local grocery store. I am obsessed with this bird feeder and I wanna say it's around $17. The video before this is a uh, um, haul, so the prices, I tell you the true prices in that video. I can't remember all of them right now, but that is it. I just wanted to make this area really cozy and cute for my family. And like I said, it's really neutral decor, so we can leave this out all year long, especially here in California. Um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I can't wait for you guys to see more clean and summer decorates with me, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Have a lovely day.